Shaman versus Shaman. Yeah, so it's aggro shaman versus aggro shaman, so. Yeah, just getting this. So many choices. Yeah, just. Oh. I mean, you did have the option to go double one drop right and then go into totem, but the totem golem is just so strong. Like, it's hard to fight it. Like, it is the best one drop in the game, yeah. right? Oh man. Oh man. We also see PNC having the golden card back, too. I'm quite jelly, you know? So jelly? So jelly. Yeah, he uh, did get. Was it the top four in the prelims? I, I know he was top eight in the pre. Uh, was it spring prelims? Oh man. So uh, another totem golem to follow yeah, up there. Well, it could just be the game client bugging. Sure, sure. But no, it, it looks like they're still yeah, playing, yeah. An abusive route. I guess there's a, a third option of just going face for five. Uh, this this is not bad either, because he is overloaded by one. If he's overloaded by one, you can follow up with Pharaoh Spirit the next turn, which still doesn't feel that mm -hmm. bad. And you're still establishing a pretty good board, too. Two at the moment. Don't worry, loves. The cavalry's here. Yeah, so just going with Argent Horse Rider, doing some trades, getting some value. Yeah, that instant divine heal, two for one. And now Gaiden's actually looking pretty strong. He's gonna be able to follow it up with uh, Totem into thing from, thing from Below. Or do you play Tunnel Truck? Hear Power first. You hear Power as you see if it's, yeah, if it's Spell Totem. It is Spell Totem. Ooh. But yeah, Thing From Below is way, really good way better. Well, it's so hard for the, the two Feral Spirits to actually... Because this Spell Totem mm -hmm. just entirely wipes it out, so yeah, d definitely playing the Dargent Squire is a little bit better. So even if it Lightning Storms, at least something survives, right? Because he's not going to trade it in right now yeah. just because it feels bad, and you're not going to Lightning Storm just because you're getting... I feel like you need a Lightning Storm here. It feels a little better. It should... Yeah, he's, yeah, he's going to do the Tunnel Troc, do the Lightning Storm. It's a little bit a little bit too good, because you want a total floor clear. Most of the time. Yeah, you still you get a 3-3 out of the deal too, so it's not bad at all. And now PNC has Ooh. to risk... The lightning storm. Like, okay, so he probably will be playing the lightning storm with the Pharaoh Spirit. Because he didn't decide to totem and see if there's a spell totem, but I'd, like, I guess, like, he asked It's okay, board. it's gonna roll threes all oh, across he the did board. Roll three. Well, that's still pretty good. I mean, Finley could wreck things just by it being, uh, heal, like, get priest heal instead and be able to trade into a Feral Spirit and, you know, get that endless value that they're both looking for at this point. Ooh, Doomhammer. Yeah, that changes things. That guarantees take care of one, and then you can just trade the other. Would have been the same deal if you got Priest Heal. Except you actually get to develop the uh, Doomhammer in the process. Yeah. But this... This is a pretty weak turn. But let's see if it Tonto. Tonto's one is... Faceless? The Flame Reef Faceless? How, how no, 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 no. Oh, you yeah, you're play. right. He only has yeah, three mana! Loaded. Oh yeah, the Feral Spirit's in! <laughs> Holy crap. I keep forgetting how terrible Shaman is with Overload. Mm -hmm. Always feels bad. Always feels you mean bad. I can't play my four mana seven seven on turn seven? What? Feels bad, man. Feels bad. Ooh, life tap. What you, what's your? You, yeah, that seems awesome. You also already have rock biter. I mean, I guess you could have actually chosen um, hunter hero power as well, because you know you could actually just rush down with that amount of damage. But he's still going with the uh, clear board. Yeah, because his opponent. Is at like 29 health. Oh, Maelstrom oh, there portal. We go. Sorry. New card. Uh, portal, 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 portal. Gotta remember it's portal. Yeah. Different game. Also, completely different effects. Uh, there's a, a card in Magic that's Maelstrom Pulse. It's single target, but kills all copies of the same name. Oh, that's pretty sweet. It's also sorcery speed. So slow. But yeah, pretty sweet card. It's actually insane. Yeah. Well, just yeah, pretty good. good. Alright. Pretty all right, good. Tap for the. Okay, so you could actually Rockbiter, kill the Tunnel Trog, hit face for five, Feral Spirits, and Flame Tongue. Mm -hmm. So that it does four damage to the. Ouch. Ouch. Man, that hurts. Ooh, he's going for the full clear. I guess. I guess this is pretty good, because if he wants to face, play with Faceless, you actually trade it in. Or you mm -hmm. can just abuse it. Yeah. Right Makes it impossible to be killed by. Uh. Charge minions, but still, it's gonna hurt. It's like you're at ten. Like how many spells do shamans play? They actually just go face, right? I mean, there's two. 
Lava Burst. We're still not even completely sure what build PNC is playing. Besides, you know, maybe it's... Yeah, it's pretty much aggro, but like... Uh, how many lightning bolts is he playing? Is it just the one copy, or are they still like... Possibly playing two? Yeah, possibly playing two. Uh, Ancestral Knowledge is also one of those cards that you wonder if he's playing. But it looks like he might possibly be able to clear the board in the next two turns. Anyway. Oh, never mind. Second Feral Spirit picked up. <laughs> That's, uh... Unless he gets a Lightning Storm, it's going to be pretty dream crashing. But that uh, Melstorm Portal usually takes the place of one, right? Or have they been taking out um, Flame Juggler for the portal? Oh, uh, it's probably the Flame Juggler. Yeah, Flame Juggler, because Flame Juggler, like, sometimes it doesn't hit the minion that you want, but Melstorm guarantees that the guarantees that hit, so I'm pretty sure that it's sort of flame juggling. But at least from the list that so, I've seen. But Nell Gaiden looks not like looking so great for in, uh, P and C right now. Nell Gaiden looks like he's in the upper hand right now. <laughs> all I did was remove two damage, but I guess that's all you can do. Is he dead this turn? I wish you would stop killing me <laughs> with your flipping of screens. Uh, so that's 6, 11, 14, so he's just short. He could have tapped to see if he got his uh, one copy of Lightning Bolt or another Flame Tongue. Yeah, he could definitely do that. But he is so low, if he taps, then he's dead to um, the opponent's Flame mm -hmm. uh, Lava first. So many different things that he could just die to. Oh wow, oh. he would have died too. <laughs> <laughs> Great call. That was, it was that close, see? These matches are so swingy. Yeah. <laughs> Even with that board, PNC almost came back. Like, yeah, prob just one top deck. If his opponent just tapped, you know, maybe got greedy looking for uh, lethal that turn, you know? Yeah, like with more one misplay, it would have been all over. 